Imagine that you live in a repressive country. There are elections, but they are fake. The leader wins 100% of the vote each time. Security forces beat up opposition leaders and harass everyone else, and they get away with it. This is a country where watching this video right now would get you on a list. Now let's say you've had enough, and so have lots of other people that you talk to in low whispers. You decide to act, but what's the best way for you to challenge the system and create major change? Arm yourselves, right? Power flows from the barrel of a gun. Wrong. Violent insurgencies usually don't work. Terrorism is even less effective. But hope is not lost. There is a way that millions of people worldwide have fought back against oppression. They've won far more often than those who have taken up arms. Nonviolent civil resistance. Mass campaigns where people withdraw their cooperation from an oppressive system. From 1900 to 2006, nonviolent campaigns worldwide were twice as likely to succeed as violent insurgencies, even in extremely repressive authoritarian systems. So why is civil resistance so much more effective than armed struggle? People power. Want to see what people power looks like? We'll show you. You'll be amazed.